27th, you can see this aircraft had a runway excursion almost through the bushes and into the streets. You can hear, see it here from the top. It looks like a fire, but I believe that's just the lights from the localizers as it came through those antennas. It was an Embraer EMB 505 Phenom 300 November 16 Delta Fox shot was the tail number. And it happened here at this Hawthorne Municipal Airport. Tried to land on runway 25. It had available landing distance of 4,193 feet. But still overran it and hit the antenna. So here you can see there's the localizers there. I believe it ran through here and went and landed into these bushes almost onto the street. So here it is up close. You can see the street in the distance. Here's that shrub at the end of the runway. So luckily it stopped there because it could have went into the street, maybe hit some cars. But nobody was injured on this one, which is very good. But here it is from the street side looking at into the airport. You can see it's right along that uh, the fence line of the airport. And then here, firefighters are on scene. I don't believe there was any fire or fuel spills they had to deal with. It's just the passengers. And you can see the doors open. They probably just walked out a little shaken up. But all in all, they were okay on this one. Moving on, December 26, we're in Annapolis, Maryland. You can see this aircraft stuck in the ice here. A sole pilot with minor injuries had to ditch. Pilot got out before it submerged, which is luckily... Because you can imagine if this uh, pilot was trapped in this aircraft as it went through the ice. He won a Cherokee Warrior November 1867 Hotel. It's the tail number. But here it is. It was shortly after takeoff from this Lee Airport in Maryland. Had some engine power and ended up in that frozen uh, Beards Creek as you can see. And then here's some numbers for you. So firefighters are on scene. At first responders came. Medics. Police. Ended up waiting here at the creek trying to figure out how to respond to this and get the pilot out safely without injuring any of the firefighters or any of the responders. But I believe there was some kayakers that went out and saved the pilot. Thank you, Mike Hug Media, for these pictures. And then police is on scene as well. So good job to this Annapolis Fire Department and all the responders here to go ahead and make another save. They departed from runway 30 at about 1521 from that Lee Airport. So please subscribe to the channel. I will keep you updated. Hope everybody's doing great. This is Arfaram Kioni. See you guys next time.